What up, it's Melvin7 here and today I'm bringing you another episode of Dub OL. Let's see what EA have released. So, SBCs, have they gave us anything? Ooh, there's an Anderson Taliska Rule Breakers card. Four star, four star, high, low work rates. What's the differences for him? So he's got decent pace there, the acceleration's very, very high. Decent stamina, his passing is 80s across the board apart from crossing. Uh, same as shooting except for penalties and volleys which eh, aren't too relevant. Dribbling, very solid, 80s across the board again with agility being 90 but balance a little off at 79. It looks like a decent card to be honest. Obviously he's in the Ch uh, Chinese league so Unless you've got a Brazilian squad, he's going to be fairly hard to link. But he is quite an overpowered card in general, uh, usually. And he only requires one segment, so we'll see what rating you need. An 85. Okay. So I'm guessing that's roughly about 50k at the minute. 50 to 60k. It's not bad. I think on the market, this Taliska, because of the name that he is, would probably be about that. About 50 to 100,000 on the market. So you know what? If... If he fits your team, go ahead and do him. I don't know if I'm going to do him because, again, I, I just I don't think I can fit him in. I don't really have too many Brazilians, so it's probably not one that I'm going to do. But, you know, it's there. So we've got UEFA marquee matchups. I'm just going to check if there's anything else. That looks as though it's it, um, which is fair enough. You know, uh, a player thing and a little puzzle set. Um, but we'll, we'll see what the uh, what the marquee matchups are, and then we'll see if there's any objectives. Probably not. Right. So you need one rare player, Marseille or Man City players. One max league three. You get a rare gold pack and a rare mixed players pack. This isn't bad. Uh, you don't need any CL players for this, which is weird, because last time you needed Champions League cards when they literally just been put into packs. But now that they've been there for a week. People have probably stocked up on them. You don't need them. So, yeah, that's that's interesting. But, yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Again, oh, we're going to complete this, of course, in the video. Um, and then we'll check what objectives there are. So we need a, a Marseille or a Man City player. As I say, every single video, I only have rares because I keep clearing them out to do two-player packs and I keep getting shafted, so I need to stop doing that. But, yeah, Ruben Diaz is untradeable for me, so I don't mind putting him in. Um, players from same league max three, fair enough. So we'll just just do the standard sheet. Uh, most of these cards are seven hundred coins on the market anyway, uh, so I don't mind using them really. Uh, oh, again, menu lag. The the update came out for consoles and it hasn't fixed a damn thing in terms of uh, menu lag. I also had a weird glitch. I don't know if anyone else has had this. Three players were standing in the middle of the pitch. They weren't in my team or anything. It was like they were posing for a FIFA uh, front cover. And uh, yeah, they just wouldn't move the entire game. Like you could uh, go through them. It just, they, they just wouldn't move. It, it was so weird. I don't know if anyone's had that, but they were there the full 90 minutes. And yeah, I, you could run through them. It was like there were ghosts on the pitch. It was weird. Um, but anyhow, right. Enough of that. Uh, we're just going to finish off this one. Actually, probably be better getting a winger. You only need 75 chemistry. And too fat, he's cheap as fuck anyway. Um, right. Now, let's see if we can use like an obscure league that I never use. Turkish league. Do we have anything there? Really? I don't have any Turkish league players. Ah, okay. That'll, that'll do. The, the 75s don't really go for anything now. Um... Yeah, that, that's complete overkill. Uh, definitely be more meticulous than I am. Use the same sort of formula, but just use um, non-rares, of course, or common cards, as they are called. Right, so this one, Syria and La Liga. What else do we need? Clubs, minimum five. Rare players, minimum two. Right, that is... I like that. I like when it's that easy, when you can literally just use one league um, and then just stick another player from the other league that it requires. That's absolutely fantastic so we're gonna get this done um oh wow i really don't have many la liga players damn hmm that's weird right we're gonna stick kubo in there and there's no specific rating uh this time <laughs> like uh whatever the other one was called the the rule breakers sbc uh that was very divisive in the fifa community shall we say 
I didn't mind it. It just, yeah, understandably, some people were annoyed. Uh, and, yeah, some people didn't like it. Right, now we just need Serie A players, and there we go. Um, right. No, not Bundesliga. Again, lag. That isn't me. I'm, I'm clicking the button, but it's just lagging. Oh, you know what? I can probably get away with anything. Um, put Jay Rodriguez in there and then do that. That'll be fine. Yeah, there we go. Right, so we get uh, two 25k packs, one of the each variety, and then a rare mixed player pack, which I quite like. They're sometimes pretty good. Right, now we've completed that. We'll see if there's any objectives. We'll open the packs, and yeah, that'll be it for this video, I guess. So objectives, I've pretty much done everything on offer, other than co-op and conquer, which I need three more for. But yeah, it doesn't look as though they've released anything, unless there's anything in Milestone which there is not by the looks of it and then of course on teams we're still uh, as we were i've almost got that uh, prime premier league pack which i think is what i'm going to unlock but yeah two days left on that so yeah no objectives just you wait for marquee matchups on that Tiliska, i think that Tiliska is a win uh you know he, he's a very good card in the game he's meta and that um foot i keep forgetting the the rule breakers card looks pretty good so you know if you're rocking a brazilian squad why not for 50 60k it's completely your choice as we get tadic but yeah I, I think it's a dub uh price isn't too high and card's good so it's a dub for me oh we get that serbian link in there with uh, tadic and matic ah <sighs> right we'll just open them in order oh come on i've been devoid of walkouts for so long come on it's not a walker. It's another board, though. Back-to-back -back boards for the first time in a long time. Oh, not Tadic. Okay, it's Kostic this time. <sighs> These Serbian boards be killing my packs. C83. Yeah, he is. Ooh, what's the pack? Be something good. Be something good. Ooh, player pack. Not bad. Not bad. All right, I'm just going to discard those. And, uh, yeah, we might as well open that to... Two player pack. This is free. What are we? What are we gonna get from this free pack? Uh, it's not a walkout. I mean, uh, it's a UCL card or a Conan Ball. I saw the blue flares. See which one? Of course, Conan Ball. The the less useful variety. So anyhow, the last pack, uh, half of a thirty k pack. So we'll call it a fifteen. Um, come on, come on, come on, come on. Not a walkout. Not a board. Okay, well, not great in terms of my rewards, um, but hopefully you did get a little bit better, but it's cheap. It's much cheaper than last week. You don't need a Champions League card. You can probably get both those teams done for about 10, maybe 15,000 coins max. So in terms of UEFA marquee matchups, big, big dub. Taliska, a dub. So yeah, today, dub.